assalamu alaikum friends welcome back to my youtube channel dr crochet today i'm going to show you how to make this beautiful sauce it's very easy and simple so let's start how to make it first of all we need a crochet hook i'm using 4 mm crochet hook and double ply wool yarn i'm using red gray white and black color you can use colors of your own choice let's start with the base color gray Make a knot and chain 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now chain 2. That count as half double crochet. Yarn over, skip the first chain and insert hook in the fourth one and drag the yarn and make a half double crochet. Now make one half double crochet in each chain. Make two half double crochet in last chain. And one half double crochet in each chain from wrong side. As before, I am going to make two half double crochet in the first two chains that count as one half double crochet and join with slip stitch to the top of first half double crochet. Now chain two that count as one half double crochet and make one half double crochet in the second one and two half double crochet in next stitch and one half double crochet and two half double crochet in next stitch continue working like this one and Two in the other one. Join with the top of first half double crochet with slip stitch. Now we have got this shape. You can increase or decrease the number of chains according to your toe size. Now chain two and one half double crochet in each stitch. Continue working for 6 rows. Now here I have completed 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 rows. Now insert hook from the top of the first stitch and instead of making a slip stitch I am going to join back color. 
so insert hook from the top of first stitch yarn over and drag the yarn chain 2 that is equal to 1 half double crochet now make 1 half double crochet in second stitch then now I am going to make a double crochet front post insert hook from the previous half double crochet from right side and drag the yarn and make a one double crochet like this again two half double crochet one and two and one double crochet front post like this now continue working one half double crochet two half double crochet and one double crochet front post one half double crochet two half double crochet and one double crochet front post continue working like this then now insert hook from the top of first stitch and instead of dragging the same yarn I'm going to add the next color drag the yarn chain 2 pull this yarn to make it tight now one half double crochet in the next stitch and then front post one double crochet front post from the previous one again one half double crochet two half double crochet and one double crochet front post continue on the same pattern for nine rows after completing this color I am going to add white color and then gray Here, black red white and gray so after nine rows completing these nine rows one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven sorry after completing these eleven rows uh, let's see I have completed 12 rows now inserting hook in the top of the first stitch and draw back the base color and the last to complete now see here I have completed 12 rows of this pattern now I here I have completed this pattern. Here we have 30 stitches. So I'm going to make chain 3 that count as 1 double crochet and 1 double crochet in each stitch. For 20 stitches, I'm going to make 1 double crochet. 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 
20. Now here I have made 20 double crochets and skipping these 10 stitches. Now chain 3 and turn. Skip the first stitch and make 1 double crochet in the next one. row chain 3 and turn and skip the first stitch and make one half double crochet complete in make one double crochet in each of the stitch here i have made Five rows of double crochets. Now have made five rows of double crochets now chain two one and two then make one half double crochet in from this side make one half double crochet here and one Half double crochet, then make one half double crochet here and continue all the way. I'm going to join these together. I'm in that hook here, the first stitch, and join with the slip stitch. Now I'm going to cover the top area. Then I'm uh, I see this with the help of needle. I saw this. and make one half double crochet in the next one and one double crochet front post in the next stitch I have completed five rows now join with the first stitch with slip stitch chain two and make half one half double crochet in each stitch Join with the slip stitch to the top of first stitch and 
thread the yarn Now it's complete. Hope you like this pattern. It's quite simple and easy. You can try it. It's very easy to make. Hope you like my video. Keep watching and do like and subscribe my channel. Goodbye.